Hey friends, it's Jessie. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a new Project Pan video. I have a very interesting relationship with makeup. I always love to purchase new things and try all the new makeup, but I also really like to go through my makeup. I've been binge watching lots of Project Pans. I'm currently doing two, the Project Pan Those Eyeshadows, which was started by Lexi, and the A to Z Project Pan. I don't actually know who started that. So if anyone knows who started the A to Z Project Pan, let me know because I definitely want to start linking them in the description boxes. But today I decided to start a third Project Pan. This one, I think in, priority list is not going to be the top priority, but I figured it would still be fun to add in and give me an excuse to play with my palettes. So this is the Project Level Up, which was started by Sophie here on YouTube. I will link her channel in the description as well. It's a really hard project to explain, but essentially for my level one palette, I'm going to randomize a palette in my collection. I have to use every shade in that palette at least one time, and I have to hit pan on one shadow. For level two, I'm going to randomize a new palette. I'm going to use every shade in that palette two times and hit two pans in that palette and so on and so forth. So to start off, I've seen most people do this one palette at a time. I feel like I'm more of a two palette at a time kind of gal. So I'm going to randomize my level one and level two palettes. I'm a bit extra. I have this notebook that I keep all of my panning progress in. And if you go all the way to the back, I have written out every single eyeshadow palette in my collection. For my Panless eyeshadows, I do have an Excel spreadsheet. I'm not crazy enough to write out that many shadows, but according to my list, I have 216 palettes to choose from. So I'm gonna go ahead and randomize two numbers. I have my Google random number generator, and actually, I feel like I never show this side, so let's go ahead and do it together. So I inputted one through 216, and the first palette we get is number nine, and the second palette we are going to be working on is palette 185. I'm gonna go ahead and match up the corresponding numbers. Okay, this actually might not be that bad. Let me go grab those palettes, I'll be right back. The reason I decided to work on two palettes at once is just because I feel like if I do one palette at a time and I don't hit pan or don't meet the goal one month, I just don't want this video series to get boring. And at least if I'm working on two palettes at once, then I have double the chance. Let's go ahead and share the palettes. I'm actually quite excited about these. My level one palette is my Melt Blueprint palette. And I have had this for a while. This was one of the first palettes I purchased when we moved to Utah. I purchased it when it first came out. And I have been dabbling in this one a little bit, but if I'm honest, I haven't really, I don't think I've played with every shade in here. So I'm excited that this will be my level one palette. I don't want to confine myself to which shade I'm going to try and pan, but if I'm being completely honest, I think Skylight, this light one, might be the one that I hit pan on because it's going to be very easy to use as an inner corner or a brow bone highlight. I do really like this palette the couple times I've reached into it, and I have been thinking about this one a lot recently. It's like the panning gods always know what's up with me. And my level two palette comes from ColourPop. It is the Hello Kitty and Friends Snow Much Fun palette. So my goal in this palette will be to hit pan on two shadows and use every shade twice. I'm not sure which shades immediately I'm gonna wanna hit pan on. I'm almost thinking Burr Baby and Cuddle Weather, these two like pinky lavender shades, but it could be any of them. So, okay, apparently it is not winterful. Does that count as hitting pan in a shadow? I know this video was super short, but that is all for today's video. I, I'm gonna be trying to do monthly updates. I feel like I'm on a schedule right now where I have at least one panning content related video per week on my channel, which I think is really fun. So I am going to try and mix this in. I think my A to Z project pan is the first week. Project Pan Those Eyeshadows is the third week, and this will be like the second or fourth week of the month. But I am excited to see the progress I make, and if you're interested in seeing all the progress I come up with next time, make sure you're subscribed and turn that notification bell on so you never miss my panning project updates. I will see you guys all in the next one, friends. Bye!